You can sit here and complain about George Soros all you want. The guy is an evil, evil, horrible human being. But guess what? He started making investments in the 80s to build for today. He started making investments in socialism and things that would bring this country down knowing that he was playing a long game. We have to start thinking about the long game. We have to start thinking about those independents. Right? And like I said, we got a great product. So let's highlight the things that go a few things. Some things that bring us together. We can all agree on Republicans on being pro-business. We can all agree on being about individual liberty. We can all agree on having local control and low taxes. Independence like that. Young people like that. But man, we get ourselves tied up in issues that I'm not saying they're not important, but they ain't making the team bigger. <laughs> and unless you unless we start breaking through the echo chamber, and I said this to the folks at Fox, I talked to other guys at Fox, I love what people do this morning. And I talk to the leadership at Fox all the time. I said, look at it. You're talking. I, I saw a panel discussion with like four panelists on Fox, and they all were literally agreeing with each other. I said, what are you doing? I said, great, we all agree. We would all watch that panel and say, yep, I agree, I agree, I agree. They're talking in an echo chamber. What are you doing to grow the team? What are you doing to have a better, more broader product? And then we don't know what we're going to lose. I want winners. Famous former leader once said, I don't like losers. Losers lose. And look, we can all try to convince ourselves that 2022 wasn't so bad. 2022, we got our asses kicked. And let's own that. We did. We did. And if we were 24, like we made 22, it's going to happen again. And we'll all be sitting here going, oh, why did we lose? Because we did it the same way. We didn't have the courage to evolve our message, to be inspirational. Who wants to get on the team when they're always getting yelled at? Right? We have all these uh, folks that are in their leadership positions that are yelling at each other, and they're screaming, and they're negative, and they're bashing this, and they're bashing that. But no one wants to be on that team. This is America. We want to be inspired.